Welcome to another how-to video from Blue Butterfly Creations. And in front of you is the web address for my blog spot. It's blue without the e, butterflycreations.blogspot.com. And today I'm going to show you a two-page layout in the Halloween theme, and this one's going to be spiders. So, to start, I have two sheets of 12 by 12 black paper. I used two sheets of this nice deep purple and a sheet of a lighter purple. Now I'm going to show you what I did here and on another video you'll see how I did the embossing but this is a spider web embossed with white powder. I have already adhered two fuzzy spiders and then I applied two tags, one with a spider, one that says Happy Halloween these tags are from the Making Memories Halloween theme pack. And the spiders are lion, sandal lion essentials. So I have that on. Then I have my photo mat here. This is a 7.5 by 5.5 mat in the purple. Peeling my adhesive. And I'm going to place it on a slight angle. And that's the first page. The second page is again that 12 by 12 black paper. I've already done my powder embossing to the lower right hand corner for that spider web. I got a spider on there. Then I have my journaling square which I took that dark purple and that is cut to four and a half by four and a half my inner light purple which is a four by four square I adhered those together and dry powder embossed another spider web in black and added a spider so that's my journaling square I'm going to go ahead and peel my adhesive off the back of it and I want that in the upper right hand corner I'm doing a slight angle keeping the fact it's Halloween it's a little off tilter you know the spooky houses and then I have three squares that are three and a half by three and a half for photos those are out of the deep purple as well I'm going to peel the backing to my adhesive And I'm going to be placing them towards the left hand side. I have them about quarter inch to half an inch in from the sides. And these I'm going to stagger. Again, to make it look kind of eerie. Kind of like the bricks in an old house, how they tend to shift out from each other. And I'm just going to overlap this one in a little right about there then my last one now on my blog spot underneath one of my earlier entries is a how to on to do the powder embossing how to pick powders and how to pick papers to use how to use them with stamps and how to do them freehand. So feel free to reference that as you go ahead and do your own. Then I went ahead and I cut out my title using Teardrop for the Cricut at a little over an inch to an inch depending on your size paper and what you want to say. Mine is cut at an inch and a half and I did mine with the shadow so I have the dark purple as the shadow the light purple as my letter so it kind of matches so it matches my journaling box my title is the spider webs so I'm going to take my letters I'm going to put them in this spot here Ooh, off from each other Like so. And 
And I kept the first letter in each word capitalized, but the rest of them are lowercase. There. So there is a 12 by 12 two page layout with the Halloween theme. Thank you for watching this video. And again, you can check out my blog spot. It's bluebutterflycreations.blogspot.com for tips and information on this layout.